is Afternoon Sports Slay with the Queen, Mikey K. Now remember, I'm doing this for the love of the game. This was the main event, PBC on Fox. Boxing is back, all right? Now this was the interim, all right? WBA, welterweight title, Jamal James, 26. 1-0 with 12 KOs. Thomas Delorme, 25-3-1 with 16 KOs. Now, I meant to get to this one sooner, but listen, at least I'm about to deliver the juice for you guys right now. Now, this fight was very active from the start. A lot of activity, a lot of punches were thrown. Right in the beginning, James used his reach really well, okay? Nice foot movement. Both came out very aggressive, especially the start of round three until the end of the fight. Thomas delivered good quality, powerful body punches at certain points in the fight. James had good body punches too. The difference to me with Jamal, he came through with good consistent combinations, plus was definitely the more accurate fighter. I like what I saw from Jamal with him angling his defense in round six. Good straight right hands consecutively, okay, from Jamal in round round seven now in round 10 Thomas you know showed a little something too as well he was still really aggressive had some nice uppercuts but it just wasn't enough Jamar and his team stuck to the game plan he utilized his reach well throughout the whole fight all right nice combinations definitely boxed well on the inside and the outside okay so it was really just a good job overall from Jamar now also I felt like overall the fight was pretty good now the only thing that I would say about Jamal that I would like to see that I feel like he needs to improve upon would definitely have to be his you know power punching ability now the welterweight division got a lot of heat leave a comment below let me know who you think Jamal should fight next now of course you know in the welterweight you got Earl Spence you got Terrence Crawford you have Keith Thurman Sean Porter you got a lot of people now I saw on YouTube in the, in the title of the boxing voice it said that Jamal wanted to fight Manny Pacquiao next and I think that's a no-go absolutely not I don't think he should fight him now I didn't do the now I didn't watch the whole video but that was in the title so I don't know how true that is so you guys let me know as well leave a comment okay but who do you think Jamal should fight next now it's a lot of big boxing fights coming up it's gonna be crazy the juice will be there for all my slayers and slay it's definitely more content on the way definitely listen if you love basketball like I do too definitely playoff talk coming soon now remember i'm doing this for the love of the game make sure you subscribe make sure you hit the like button make sure you hit the notification bell all right it's the queen micah k i'm out